Hey, what's up guys? So I'm in the shop today because I found out how to make perfect cylinders on the lathe with a lathe and a drill press. And I thought I saw it on YouTube, I thought it was so cool as I got to make a video on my own and show you how to do this. So here it is. The first thing you're gonna need is one of these. I'm not exactly sure what it's called, but uh, normally you have a bit coming out the middle and you're gonna need to be able to take that bit out and still have the piece at the end in. So my setup is right here. I have my lathe and then I have my piece right there and you want it directly lined up straight above uh, your piece where the lathe lines up from here to here and it's coming straight down so once you have that you're set and then I'll show you how it works all right so when you start off to make this circle I start off with a uh, four by four just a couple inches long long that your circle can fit on uh, so I like to smooth this down first to starting it with a square so I moved my lathe away from my drill press, and I'm just gonna get this looking like a oval first, and then we'll start working from there. All right, got a few chips in. Decided to change the camera angle. So now it's gonna start. All right, looks good. Now it's time to move it under the lathe, or under the drill press. All right, got the drill press and the lathe all lined up. Now I just turn both of them on, press down, and we should have a perfect circle. That's the final product. So I turn this four by four into this bowl, and it's that simple. Uh, just takes a lot of setup. All right. So once you have the two, or once you have the one ball that you got out of the four by four, it looks pretty rough. It's got rough edges. You got to clean up the nubs because they don't break perfectly. This one's a little bit more finished, but um, still not near sanding where I wanted to get. So I'm gonna just go sand it real quick. All right, so now I got one of the balls sanded down pretty well, and it's pretty smooth. The real reason I wanted a ball was for this type of a kendama toy, and uh, to finish the project. But make is making a circle on your own without a uh, drill press is almost impossible. So uh, put this on a string, and I'll see how it works. All right, so it's all done. It does uh, does what I wanted it to do. Looks pretty nice. It might be a little bit big for this project, but I have some smaller bits, and I might uh, switch it out later. But uh, that's about it. Oh.